Uh, it's been really fun. It's been a good experience, you know, getting to skate with these guys every day and, um, you know, just coming to the rink every day trying to learn, trying to learn as much as I can from the veterans here and the coaching staff, and uh, it's been a really good experience so far. When you see that initial group of guys sent back to their clubs and you're still here, John wants to see more out of you. How do you take that and internalize it? Uh, just keep improving. I think, you know, that's my goal is to keep getting better every day. Um, you know, continuing to adjust to the pace, continue to grow my confidence, and I think uh, I've done a good job of that so far, so I think I'm just going to continue with that. What did you do for your confidence when Middlestat and Oposa tell the coach, hey, we enjoy playing with them in the, in the scrimmage, so you got a chance to play with them in a preseason game. That has to help your confidence when two veterans say that. Yeah, it's definitely nice to hear when, uh, you know, guys like guys of that caliber uh, enjoy playing with you, but... Uh, you know, for me, I'm just trying to be the best possible player I can. Um, you know, I'm the type of guy that likes to make my line mates better, likes to make the game a little bit easier for them out there. So, um, you know, any chance I get to, to do that, I'm, I'm taking it. What do you do you think that makes the game easier for your line mates? How do you try to do that? Uh, I think I try and support the puck as much as I can. I obviously like to play a fast game. So just when I'm moving my feet, I think that's when I'm most effective out there. Uh, I think, you know, I've gotten better at being hard on pucks in the offensive zone, being able to back check and be reliable in my D zone. So, um, you know, I think the offense will continue to come and, um, you know, the, the comfortability will just keep growing there. What's been the process like for you just acclimating to just the pace just increases, it seems, as, I mean, obviously it's a big step for prospect challenge with this, but each practice and each preseason game, right? Yeah, obviously the pace keeps ramping up, um, you know, and I like that. I like to continue to move forward and continue to get better uh, you know I think it, it's definitely a big challenge out there it's you know a, a pace of play that I've never really seen before never been used to so you know just going out there trying working working my hardest trying my best uh, I think that's uh, that's been really the recipe for success so far even the eye openers to start I mean, the first two preseason games, first two preseason games which have just taken away uh, just the limited time and space out there. Uh, it's a really fast game. You don't have much time with the puck. Uh, you know, it's it's really important to trust your line mates, have good communication with them. And I think the, the guys I've played with so far have done a really good job, you know, getting me more comfortable in the game. And um, I think it'll just continue to build on that. Did you get used to the speed of the NHL game quicker because you play a speed game yourself? Yeah, I think, you know, you can never really be prepared for – uh, the pace of play that they're playing at going from junior hockey, but I think my skating ability definitely helps that to uh, be able to, you know, keep up with the pace and, and even excel it. And, um, you know, I'm, I really like to play a fast game out there. That's when I'm at my best. And, um, you know, just continuing to move my feet is, is how I'll stay effective. It seems like you're getting comfortable here. Tuck said you gave him a hard time in the locker room at your 5-0 and in a Sabres jersey. <laughs> yeah, uh, <laughs> just threw it out there. We came in and uh, felt pretty good about it. So, uh, yeah, it was just just talking to older guys like that, Tucky, Ocposo, uh They've been really good to me, just easing me into things, getting me more familiar with the group. And they got such an awesome group here, coaching staff, players, the whole management, and, um, you know, the whole staff here. Is, it's just been an incredible experience so far. So you do feel yeah. pretty comfortable in there now? Yeah, definitely a lot more comfortable than when I first got in here. Uh, it can be pretty nerve-wracking walking into a room with, um, you know, that those caliber players um, and, and that type of coaching staff. But I think just the guys have, have really done a good job easing me in and making me feel really welcome. At the draft, Kevin said, you know, as much as the skill, they really like your, your competitiveness. They're going in both directions. Is there anything to point to where, where that comes from? I think the household I grew up in. I grew up with an older brother who's a couple years older than me. Uh, he's, he's with the Oilers organization right now, and it was always competitive at the house, you know, trying to outdo one another, whether that's shooting pucks in the basement, playing one-on-one, -on -one, and I think that's, for the most part, where that internal competitive drive comes from. Obviously a skilled skater and keeping up with the fast game. Is there anything else this adjustment has forced you to look at differently in your game? Yeah, I think, um, you know, from just watching watching over the games I've played, just knowing how much time and space you have, being able to sense pressure, hold on to pucks a little bit more, I think that's an area I can continue to, to get better at, and um, I'll really focus on that moving forward. Sabres just teased that they're getting a new puppy. How do you feel about dogs? I'm a big dog guy. Uh, you know, I got a dog back home, and uh, I love it. So I'm really excited for that. I didn't know that, but uh, I'm glad. I'm glad you told me that. What kind of dog do you have? 
I have a uh, soft coated Wheaton Terrier. His his name's Deke. So pretty yeah, pretty hockey family there. And then speaking of the draft, obviously you had a suit jacket to remember. What's your game day style gonna be like? Uh pretty similar. I actually got that suit here, so I'll probably end up wearing that for a few games and um, yeah, I just like to you know keep things mixing up. Uh, I'm a big into I'm big into Sal these days, so uh, just trying to look as good as I can for the games.